Well, folks, it's good to be back from vacation. Uh, had a great time, took a cruise, and uh, we're going to get some uh, pictures out there at some point during the week, maybe a slideshow. I think that'll be fun. But uh, back to reporting. Uh, back in December last year, we reported on outrage. Uh, South Korean president forced to step down while people find out she's involved in satanic rituals, and I, we have an update about that. Uh, that is fresh, only a few days old. Ex-South Korean President Park Geun-hye arrested in corruption probe, ousted South Korean President Park Geun-hye, has been arrested and taken into custody over a corruption scandal that led her dismissal. The 65-year-old was driven to a detention center uh, south of Seoul after a court approved her arrest. She is accused of allowing her close friend Choi soon sil to extort money from companies, including Samsung, in return for political favors. Now, this Choi Soon Sil is the person that we were talking about, is into satan satanic ritual uh, worshiping and was uh, actually giving advice to the president, uh, Pak Gun A. So you've got uh, a, a you know, satanic worshiper uh, giving advice to Pak Gun A. Uh, they were. Uh, intimate friends in whatever manner uh, intimate means but they were very close she is accused of allowing her close friend choice and sell to extort money from companies including samsung in return for political favors miss pock was uh, removed from office earlier this month denies the claim she is the third former president of south korea to be arrested over criminal allegations yonhop reports uh, the Seoul central district court earlier issued a warrant to detain Ms. Pox while she is investigated on charges of bribery, abuse of authority, coercion, and leaking government secrets. It followed a nearly nine-hour court hearing on Thursday that Ms. Pock attended. It is justifiable and necessary to arrest Ms. Pock, and key charges were justified and there is risk of evidence being destroyed, the court said in a statement. Live television footage showed a black sedan carrying her to the detention facility from prosecutor's office where she had been waiting. Despite the early hour, some 50 supporters waving national flags and demanding her release were at the gate to greet her, the AFP uh, news agency reports. Ms. Pock has been held for, can be held for up to 20 days before being formally charged. If convicted, she could face more than 10 years in prison. Ms. Pock lost her president, uh, presidential immunity and was dismissed from her post when the Constitutional Court upheld a decision by Parliament in December to impeach her. Ms. Choi is accused of using her presidential connections to pressure companies to give millions of dollars to donations to nonprofit foundations she controlled. Ms. Pock is alleged to have been personally involved in this and to have given Ms. Choi unacceptable levels of access to official documents. Uh, judges had said the former president has uh, broken the law by allowing Ms. Choi to meddle in state affairs and had breached guidelines on official secrets by leaking numerous documents. Ms. Choi and Samsung's acting head, Lee Yang Yang, also involved in the scandal, are being held in the same detention center to where Ms. Pak is, has been sent. They are also being tried separately. Huang Kaio Han Huang Kaoyang, sorry about that, folks, some tough names, who is loyal to Ms. Pak, is now the acting president, and, uh, and an election will be held May 9th. So the reason why I'm doing a follow-up on this, folks, is to, to show you that uh, big fish can fry, and they do in other countries. We just need some big fish to start frying here. So much to report, folks, but I'll leave the link to the original uh, story. So we have a story up uh, about this from uh, December. We've got a video and now the update today. Once again, it's good to be back. I uh, hope everybody had a great week. And uh, we're coming out some with some uh, Robert Steele stuff coming out later. Uh, also, I will report on our upcoming interviews that we have coming up. Some real exciting people. Once again, God bless you folks. Take care.